one of your favourite episodes, I believe, which is Day of Disaster. Well, of course. Uh, of course, most listeners will know, but it's the one where a Martian space pro rocket falls off a bridge and ends up being stuck at the bottom of a river. Mm-hmm. You know that one. All yeah. very dramatic. Anyway, Penelope and Parker in that episode are tasked with causing a distraction to divert the attention of onlookers in order to give Brains a chance to sneak up to the bridge's control room. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So Lady Penelope being Lady Penelope... She's not the most subtle, is she? I mean, when she deals with the hood when he runs away and trapped in the sky, she blows him off the motorway and goes off and blows up and it's all a bit of a disaster. It's not really subtle dealing no. with, is it? No, no, but we don't want subtle, do we? No, of course not. No. Anyway, so as I've just described there, her idea of a distraction is probably to go and blow something up. Yeah. Specifically, in this case, an abandoned research centre, part of which is actually from Stingray. Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Thank you for that. It's the interior wall of Stingray's pen. Oh, right. So in that episode, we actually see the wall twice. Firstly, Fab One Park's in front of it. And in that shot, you can see where it used to say Stingray Pen 3. Well, it's been covered up with a panel. Ah. But otherwise, it looks largely unchanged. So you probably will recognise it. Then, later on, when Parker opens fire with Fab One's machine guns, we cut to a shot of the same wall being blasted. But now the footage has been flopped to make it look like a different building. Yeah, Good old trick there in filming. Yes, absolutely. It is yet another slightly sad indication of how easily a model from one show could become cannon fodder for another. Yeah. But there you go, we weren't going to be making any more Stingray, so uh, why not blow it up? <laughs> Fair enough, yeah. Yeah, but I mean, it does make sense, doesn't it? Yeah, of course, and by this point they had a huge stock of props yeah. and model sets and buildings and all sorts of stuff which were regularly reused. Yeah. But in this case, we need something which is going to get fire damaged. Yeah. Stingray's over. It says Stingray on it. We're going to have to cover it up and mess around with it anyway, so we might as well destroy it. Absolutely, yeah. 